Hi guys, welcome back to Silhouette Success. It is Sunday morning and this is Hot Mess Express Edition, but I want to get into setting up the curio as quickly as I can. I know there's been a little bit of a delay with the videos coming out on it. Um, life has been crazy hectic, but in a good way. I'm going to break these video da videos down into a smaller segments. Um, I did the unboxing, we're going to do a setup, and then I'm going to do a first cut material test all, all separately because I want you to be able to go to my channel, grab the information that you need quickly without weeding through 20 minutes of video. So I'm going to put out shorter segments with short to the point information. Hopefully that will help you out. Today, right now, we are going to go ahead and head over to Silhouette America and find the software version that we need to run the new machines. Now this is a beta edition. It is not perfect, but they do have updates coming out soon. There's another beta edition um, available to certain people. I do not have access to it, but there is another version already out there being tested. So hopefully that will get to us quickly. Anyway, let's go to Silhouette America now. Once you're on their website, you are going to go over to software click on get software and right here you'll see the download button it should be blue and underneath that you will see v4.5.735 that is the version that you need to run all of the new machines so let's go ahead and click on download and it has zoomed up into my downloads tab here as soon as that opens up we will it's going to take a minute one thing you are going to need when working with the new machines is some patience okay so it has opened up here just going to click on that um Welcome to the Silhouette Studio Setup Wizard. We are going to click Next. This is on a Windows computer. It is showing which file that it's going to go to. You can choose a different location, but I'm just going to hit Next and then Install. Do you want this? Do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device? Yes, because we trust Silhouette Studio. It does say that it may take several minutes. You may want to have some coffee on hand. Since it is Sunday morning, there may be some background noise. I have a house full of boys, which I absolutely love. It's just not always conducive to recording tutorial videos, but disregard. Okay, so it seems to have done its thing here, and I am going to click on Finish. And now it is going to open up Silhouette Studio 4.5. I am running the Business Edition. You do not have to have the Business Edition to run the new machines, but I highly recommend it. If you have it in your budget at all, the features in the Business Edition are phenomenal. I guess it helps if you actually click on the little icon in the taskbar. Okay, so this is new. Welcome to Silhouette Studio. How well do you know Silhouette Studio? 
and um, you have three options. You have beginner, experienced, or professional. I'm going to click on professional, um, but you want to choose whichever level you are at. So then it's going to walk you through what is new in the software. Um, specialty tools panel, find useful design features for all of your specialty tools all in one place. Again, I cannot wait for these things to come out. I am super excited and I am out of patience. Let's click next. Auto sheet feeder. I do not have one of these, but it is on the list. As soon as my bank account recovers, click next. You can now get started with Silhouette Studio. Would you like to view the page setup guide? Let's go ahead and view it. Okay, which Silhouette machine will you be using today? We are going to be using Curio, but that looks like the old Curio. Which cutting mat will you be using today? Okay, I think that this is not what we're looking for because it is not showing the Curio too. So let's go back. Just know that this is an option for you to be, for you to choose which machine you're working with. Let's close this out. Okay, we are going to finish up with this video for today. The next one coming out is going to be downloading the firmware and getting the Curio 2 ready to cut. Give me just a little bit. I am trying to work as quickly as I possibly can. I know that everyone wants, needs, must have this information like right now. I'll see you there.